Hello, so today I'm happy to <laughs> show a new contraption. Um, it's basically a fully flat shulker display. So like any other display, when the box gets emptied, um, you get a new one fooled. And so um, it looks really bad right now, but I might try to make it a bit smaller later. But that's the design I have currently. So I'll just show how it works. You take a box. And then, yeah, you get a new one, basically. And why it's so big is just because it was super hard to make it flat. The only thing that's not flat is the um, comparator, but that's impossible to make flat, really. Um, I don't know how... Um, so, yeah, it would be fully flat, even though you cannot put block higher than this, but it is flat technically. Well, not really, but anyways. So how it works is uh, simple. You got your um, input here, and then you got a little path of um, droppers and dispensers, and this comparator sees if there's something left in the shulker and then um take rate i'll show afterwards so when this gets off the pistons retract and this observer sees that and sends a pulse here and this observers uh go up to dispense on those um droppers so they the shulkers can travel um, this um, observers starts the light here as well as this one and then it transfers to this one here and then it powers the rail and then you have a row here that push all the piston up and it's really about timing so I cannot explain every timing in this video but there's a lot of like observers in all of the directions because there's a lot of timing to get um, all of those uh, blocks to go up and then retract because you need um, it was really hard because you need something to power the dispenser at the end and the only way I, f I thought was placing an observer here so when it gets retracted um, it powers but because of this and it, it gets really complicated so uh, and then the part under here is, is just a t flip flop so it gets dispensed here then it gets powered here um this is the part that i think could be reduced a lot because if we just we can remove all of here everything here we can remove and when this piston goes down you can just place a block and it will work but uh, it has to be done with the right timing so when you do it by hand it's really easy but when it comes to doing it tile ball plus in a with the right delay it gets harder so yeah so but it works i'll just show in slow motion so it gets retracted those to activate they power at the same time and then the cycle starts so you can see uh, the thing breaking up and then to start the uh, coming back you know, this piston and then it does the cycle backwards in a different order and the everything should work gets popped back and then um, because here you get it when it retracts it uh, starts it again but like a bit differently so everything can retract well so um yeah the only downside uh, right now with the design is when you get something here you need to wait a little bit for this to reset like i would not spam it but i've and you can do a uh, like this on the side and it will work but i wouldn't like spam one shulker i mean i can try it right now to see if it works but i doubt it it might break it let's see yep 
yeah so maybe just don't spam the shulker but uh apart from that um i mean it's not that slow like you get a little bit of delay to do the cycle backwards but apart from that and then um you can get your output here with um copper is going sideways and the input going directly where you want so that's also a, a downfall is to save space i do the upper going in a direction and well it's styleable but it would be better if the output was like like this so every slice doesn't rely on another slice because if you need to put something here well you cannot because you need the output um i'm sure this design could be reduced if you were to use um minecart with hoppers like probably by a lot but since i did not want to use entity um because on a large scale it would make it a lag um yeah that's pretty much why I, I chose to not do it with entities so that's the first design that i got that works fully flat and i'll try to come up with upgraded design i guess and yeah if you have any proposition or question you can ask them in the comment the schematic will be available on my website and that's pretty much it bye bye